What is up guys, it's Tom and FC, I've been back in the house with a brand new Schalke Carrier Mode episode. As you can see, the Champions League campaign has been a total, utter disaster for us. Three games, three losses. So it's almost mission impossible now to qualify to the next round, but we will keep trying. I want to at least finish third to keep our European campaign alive and at least qualify for the Europa League but who knows we might win our last three games and might qualify for the next round of the Champions League let's try and win each game as it comes Schalke against Benfica what a titanic battle this will be Benfica have won all their games they are on nine points we are on zero as you can see so on paper they are the favorites but the games aren't played on paper so let's try and win it to give us a slight hope of advancing in the Champions League. Oh my god, what a hit! We almost conceded just uh, like the fourth minute, that was an amazing shot. Glad it didn't went in. Uchida! Ref, ref, there we go! That's a great, great decision referee. Oh yes, such a relief. Come on, let's convert the penalty. I mean, look, look, what a tackle. That's disgusting. Come on, Farfan, please. Please, Farfan, this is such a vital, vital chance. Yes, yes, Farfan, 1-0. The goalkeeper went the right way, but it was right way, but it was like close to the middle. That's a great, great finish. Jefferson Farfan one nil, up and running in the Champions League. Hopefully, we can win this game and give us a slight hope for advancing to the next round. Yes, Ter Stegen, that's a great take. Lovely, lovely save, Ter Stegen. Brilliant. Farfan! Yes! <laughs> what a run! <laughs> Jefferson Farfan is the man of the match so far. I was silent because I was concentrating so much. And I thought Farfan will be dispossessed, but we hit Benfica with a quick counter-attack. And Farfan just out-muscles, out-paces everyone, and then he finishes it off brilliantly. 2-0. This looks really, really promising now, guys. Hopefully we can hold on for the three points and the vital win. That's a great finish by Farfan. No, 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 don't... Oh, don't let him... Why did you let him have the ball, defender? I was pressing the circle button to clear the ball, but the defender was outjumped by the attacker. You can't do much about that sometimes. And basically, Ter Stegen couldn't save from close range. Yeah, the defender just was out of position a little bit. Damn it, Benfica are back in it. This will be a tense last like 35 minutes. Oh, what a miss! I thought I would score. What an absolute howler of a miss. He couldn't defend the cross and he basically missed an open goal. Damn it. Are you serious? Are you serious? They are... Wow. I can't believe it. How on earth did he... Why... Why was he onside? Damn it. I can't believe it. They just let him run through and he chips the goalie. Wow. Salai! 
No, oh come on. He surely can finish that. Boateng! Another save by the goalie. Cross it. Cross it. Come on. Head it, head it. Please. Wow. Three chances and we couldn't score. Damn. Salai, are you serious? Fuchs, please, please, what the fuck is that? What on earth are you doing? Just kick the ball, you noob. Unbelievable, I can't believe this game, man. How on earth did we not win? Yeah, okay, we lost the Tuni lead, but after that we had like four or five chances to win it. 3-2. That's just... Wow, man, we got E8. In the Champions League, nothing is working for us. Even when we play this well, basically they scored, they had two shots on target. And they scored two goals. Unbelievable, Jeff. It would be an absolute miracle if we qualified to the next round now. Damn it. So here is how the Champions League group looks like and it's a total, utter disaster. I apologize for these guys. I really can't buy a win in the Champions League. But the good thing is... We can see a qualify for the Europa League if we finish third in the group, which is still not out of the, our hands. We can't qualify for the last 16 of the Champions League because Anderlecht are already 8 points ahead of us. But if we beat CSK in Moscow and maybe win or draw the next game, then we can definitely uh, qualify for the Europa League. So let's try and do that, guys. And now let's play Werder Bremen. As you can see, we are in a... Fourth place, we can go third if we win our next game against Werder Bremen at home. We played a brilliant cup game against them uh, in the cup. So, well, that was a retarded sentence. Uh, yeah, so let's try and win it. Come on, guys. So, guys, uh, my suggestion is let's forget the Champions League disappointment for a couple of games and let's try and climb up the table in the Bundesliga. We can go third if we win this game by uh, two goals uh, but we can technically go uh, third on level on points with Stuttgart so it's a great incentive great motivation for this game let's go oh Salai please no no come on what a chance that was and we fucked it up damn it Salai! Oh, what is that? Come on, Salai! Great save, Ter Stegen. That was great, great, vital save. Great save, Ter Stegen. Come on, let's go. Let's go on the counter-attack. Let's make free substitutions, freshen up the team and let's try to win the game in the last like 12 minutes. Come on guys. What a save Ter Stegen is amazing in this game. Werder Bremen were all over us in the second half I have to admit. So the game ended nil nil. It was a very disappointing game. Not a thriller like the Champions League game but... Uh, to be honest, Werder Bremen were all over us in the second half, so a draw might be a good result in this game for us. I was not really on form, I have to admit, but this is a good point. We could have lost this game easily. So guys, this is how the league table looks like. Uh, Stuttgart went 5 points clear of us, but if we win our uh, game in hand, then we are only 2 points behind 3rd place, which is just absolutely brilliant. I think uh, we have no chance to finish first or second because Bayern and Dortmund are just too good at the moment and our next game will be Dortmund at home, a big big challenge. If you want to see that tomorrow then get this video to 150 likes for daily uploads of Schalke Carrier Mode. Thanks for watching guys, have a nice day, goodbye! The, uh, the first real gameplay of the Schalke next gen carrier mode and i think i will watch all the cinematics in this game just like in my liverpool carrier mode because i really want to 
explore this wonderful, wonderful, beautiful stadium and the teams are coming out.